Hi, my name is Andrea. I'm also known as the bipolar babe in the mental health community. I just want to say hello and welcome to my blog. So, and welcome to me. So I'm just very happy to be here and feel very grateful. So thank you so much. You're probably wondering where this bipolar babe name came from. Well, go to www.bipolarbabe.com and you can check us out there. But I also wanted to give you a little short story that bipolar babe is the name of a t-shirt. In May of 2009, I thought of it and I thought of the words stomping out stigma. So why would I want to wear a t-shirt like that? Well, because it would have... An impact it would have people talking about mental health like asking and it, they, it did work because people would ask me questions like what is bipolar anyway and what stigma exactly not everybody knows and so when you have that conversation starter it can be pretty effective so as well I began doing presentations in schools to youth it was awesome. I would tell my personal story. I got into some schools. I don't know how I managed to do it, but I got in and I shared my story. And one young man said to me, he said he felt less nervous about meeting his biological father now that he saw my presentation. I guess it normalized it for him. And that was the point that his dad wasn't necessarily scary or violent or terrible because that's what stigma can lead us to believe. And now I'm executive director for the Bipolar Disorders Society of BC, which is a registered Canadian charity. And it's amazing because I get to bipolar babe it full time. It's perfect. I get to stigma stomp all day, all night. And I'm just really grateful to be where I am. So when it comes to stigma, what can I say? Well, there's an internal and an external stigma in my books, in my perspective, because all of that external stuff that people did to me, I'll never forget, and it hurt me tremendously. But it also really created an internal stigma within myself, which is the way that I feel about myself, and which wasn't very good at all. But I've man been managing and been living with and surviving stigma for 11 years now and so I'm ready to topple this blog head on to be genuine with my stories and to share with you as much as possible so thanks for watching my video and take care of yourself and we'll be in touch soon